Well, hello everyone, this is Cardboard Kings, the open or open the world's best game shop of all time. Um, in Cardboard Kings, you open your own card shop by the seaside, buy, trade, and sell cards, or keep them for your own collection. Earn reputation with customers, beat your shop goals, unlock new decorations, and host exciting events to bring everyone to the best card shop in town. Yeah, so we're gonna be uh, playing some card shop key or sorry, Cardboard Kings. If you would like to see Cardboard Kings become into a series, let me know by hitting the like button down below, commenting down below, saying, yeah, I would like to see more of Cardboard Kings. Uh, this is developed by Henry's House, Oscar Britton, I think, and Rob Gross, um, and then published by Akapura or Akapara Games. Yeah, uh, this has been a um, game that's been on my radar for some time now. It's retailed at seven, or sorry, retailed at nineteen ninety nine USD. Um, if you want to pick it up for yourself for the first week here, you absolutely can. Obviously, for ten percent off, you can definitely do that. And uh, yeah, I, I don't know what's going on here. Like the, like you guys can't see it, but like when you load up this game, you don't get like a full screen window. <laughs> and this is all I've been sitting at was like this warlock card. So I didn't want to press like continue or anything because I don't know if this is going to be part of the game. Um, so let's go ahead and just like jump into it. So flip it over. Oh my God, it's the damn settings. There we go. The game looks a lot better. All right, so let's go ahead and jump into a new game here. You can have three different slots it seems. Very good. And let's go, dude. Here we go. All right, I'm excited. Executive, good evening, Mr. Wilson. I know it's late, but I thought I... But I thought it... Pertinent for you to know that. Pertinent? Oh god, here we go already showing off my uh <laughs> my skills here. CEO George Sue has died. I am aware. Of course, George Sue, the first world champion, dead at 54. There will be mourning the world over. Or there will be mourning the world over. Wait, what? There will be mourning the world over? It will be the perfect distraction from your endless failures. But, but, but uh, Mr. Wilson, these recent thefts, surely you don't blame me, right? The legendary cards were stolen from private collections. There was no way to know. We have our best men working around the clock to stop sniveling. You're a grown man. Legendary cards do not concern me as much as your apparent lack of respect for the Warlock Company. Fail us again and I will call in every favor. Greased Palm and Blacklist to hound you into an early grave. Am I being, am I being clear? Okay, so there's been uh, like there's been a death, right? Um, legendary cards have been taken, I guess. This is actually look at the look at the artwork, dude. The artwork looks fantastic. Open set. Oh, this 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 is us. Okay, all right. Um, <laughs> our card shop, dude. Right. Um, first things I take here is that we got a radio bumping, couple posters, couple like displays. We have a parrot. Why do we have a parrot? I don't know. Um, but this says bonus one customers, chance of rush hour 10%, bonus weekly request. That's average. I don't know what that is. I'm sure we'll learn more. 15, I'm assuming dollars or currency of some sort, but let's go ahead and seems, it seems like the parrot needs to talk to us. Let's talk to the parrot. This is Giuseppe, okay. Good day, big boy, squawk. I'm Giuseppe, the smoking hot co-owner of this shop. Your father and I run this place together. Well, we ran this place together. No use of dwelling on it. We gotta get this card shop reopened. Wait, you can talk? Get down to business? <laughs> Should I question him? Wait, you can talk? Wow, just, uh, wow, it's 2022, okay? <laughs> Sorry about that. Mate, I'm just having fun with you. <laughs> it's a thing hot people do sometimes. I see, okay, listen up. You need to get more cards to sell in this shop. Check the news in the tab to the right, then open the computer to buy some cards. Oh, okie dokie. All right, so, oh, God, am I blocking anything? So this is the Warlock News Network. Green cards condemned by the church for their satanic implications? Wait, what? You should buy green colored cards. They will increase in price soon. That's our news for today? Right. Check card listings. This is G-Bay. We have Big Egg Boosters, Warlock's latest release, all that glitters. What about Warlock's re latest release? So, okay, they said green cards. I wonder if it's like green bordered cards, because this is yellow, this is purple, and this is a startled banana that's that's yellow. Okay, bulk discount, there's a lot going on here, right? Um, all that glitters, let's see here. Oh, these are green, okay, right? These are green, we want these, yeah? Because they're gonna go up in value. So, City of Thieves, these cards actually look, the artwork in this game is gonna be kind of killer, isn't it? Um, how much money we got, 15 bucks? 
Let's buy, I guess, City of Thieves. Dice Devil times three. So bulk discount, 3%. Can we buy all this? $14 plus a $2 shipping fee. So, oh, that's included. So $14.20. That's perfect. Uh, check out. Payment successful. I don't know if that was a good idea or a bad idea. Uh, oh, look at this. Oh, this is so cool. There's like packs you can buy and you can like rip open some packs. So teaching time. All right. You need to put cards up for sale to make money. That's how the world works. I love it. Open your collections on the left and find a card with a high market price. Drag the card over to those stands under the window and boom, you are done. All right. Okie dokie. One thing I don't like is like you move your mouse and the whole camera moves. I, I do not. I'm not a fan of that, <laughs> but it looks like we already had like a few. Oh, my God. OK, we're open. OK, wait, wait, wait. You can't pause time. Um, right. Uh, we want this out, I guess. Right. There's a purple. Current price, 890 purchase price at four dollars. Yeah. Put out this son of a gun. That's pretty good. Um, put this out. I'm saving the greens. I'm going to hold on to the greens. Uh, I guess a blue one. What is this person asking? Oh, they're going to buy the card. Yeah, five dollars and 40 cents. Cool. And they're going to buy that card, too. Cool. All right. No rush hour today. All right. The, the little tiny bird told us. I mean, that's only a five cent profit right there. 30 cent profits for Papa Corn or Papa, Papa Unicorn. Coffin Mimic, only five cent profit there as well. OK. Oh, this guy has a question. Hello. Hello there. This is Davo. Oh, look at him. He's looking pretty. Um, <laughs> he's. You wearing swim trunks or you wearing a, about boxers? I don't understand. Good day, mate. How's things? Not bad. How about you? Ah, yeah, can't complain. There's zero hearts here. This is kind of interesting to see that there's like a heart level here. Found my cards from Yonks ago. Long story short, thought I'd mosey down and look at what's changed. So what have you got for us? Um, well, what can I do for you, Davo? Hey, mate, cop a look at this monkey bot. I'll sell it for you for $1.15. OK, if you sell it for a dollar 15, we can sell it for a dollar 90. Yeah. Uh, yeah, sure thing. Sweet. Cheers. And he gets one heart for that. OK, and then we can sell monkey bot, which we purchased for 115 and we can sell for 190. There we go. Oh, this is sick. So you can look at every single thing that you have out and see like, OK, purchase price. And what's the current price? I'm assuming every day is different. You can have viewing upcoming events. Oh, my God. It's summer, so Monday, Tuesday, I guess I've gone. Today's Wednesday. Thursday, our mail is arriving, which I'm assuming is our packaging that we ordered. Saturday looks like a Delclon visiting or Declon is visiting. I guess that's a person. Green increase value for green cards happens on Saturday. So I guess we want to really hoard in uh, green cards itself. So let's see here. So this is the big egg booster, so like booster packs, right? That's really good. Anything here? Nothing there. All right. All that glitters. Still nothing here. All right. I mean, we could we could buy a pack if we wanted to. We got 1995. Should we do it? Let's do it. No, no, let's don't do it, because then we have to wait for it to, to come in. OK, OK, we're good, right? Turn in for the night. I think we're good. What do we have in our collection? All greens. So, yeah, I'm going to be hoarding the greens until Saturday. So turn in for the night. Hold up. There's items left in your cart. Well, yeah, 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 we, we're fine with that. We don't want to get the booster pack. OK, first day, kind of spicy, I will say the naked man fears no pickpocketing. <laughs> yeah, I guess not. <laughs> so Thursday, usually quiet reputation average rush hour chance is at 10 percent. All righty. So let's go into the next day here. How is our current prices on all of our cards? Still looks like the same. That actually went up in price. Um, that's good. That's really good. Yeah, this went up five cents. And I think a few others went up also. So speed up time until opening. I, I love that you can do that. Um, we could check the card listings. Let's do that. Let's check the card listings. Damage, Warlock's latest, all that glitters. So there we go. There's a silver card. I'm going to buy this, add that to the cart, add this to the cart. And then let's see if we have any other things. Yep, let's add that to the cart. We're going all green, baby. All green. Damage. So these are actually damaged cards. Oh, this is interesting. Uh, let's add the green damaged ones, I guess, too. And we'll see what happens. So 3% bulk discount uh, looks like it's $21, uh, which sucks because we can't afford that. Let's get rid of the dollar um, 70 and the double dollar 70. And let's order that 1860. Check it out. There we go. Purchase has been made. We have a question from somebody here. Hello. How are you? This is Posty Gustav. Got some mail for you. What can I do for you, Posty or Posty? <laughs> Posty. Good morning, my man. I have got some letters for you. I'm assuming you're Harry Sue. 
Sure am. Good stuff, homie. Just sign here. Too easy, man. So is this our package? Oh, we actually get to open it ourselves? Oh. And there's our cards we ordered, right? Yep. Yep. They are. They absolutely are. Awesome. Very good. Another news today. What's our news today? So Warlock's uh, journal. So hang on a sec, people. Burger Palace include free purple cards with kids meal. So purple cards are going to be like very invaluable. That's not good for us. But we did sell the Papa Corn over there. Papa Corn. Uh, blue card there and another blue card there. All right, let's see here. Where's our collection at? We still have like a ton of green, which is not good. Hopefully we, we got to buy some other stuff. I think I think we need to buy like a booster pack here after this guy. This parrot has something to talk to us about. Just Giuseppe. Yo, Harry, most days customers will call on the phones to request specific cards. Requests are saved on the right. And when you have the card they want, drop it on the matching request to get paid. Rip them off and our reputation goes down. Give them a good deal and it might go up. Okie dokie. So this must be it right here, right? No, this one up here. Oh, hello. This guy's got a question. This is Kevin. What's up, card friends or fiends? Uh, it's your boy, Kevin, the card man. <laughs> OK, I'm I'm at this dope ass game shop in Parakeet Bay. Going to see if I if they got any cards. <laughs> Dude, I'm streaming. Roll with it, yeah? Okay, I did not realize you were streaming. This boomer does not get it. Can y'all give me an effing chat? Oh my god! Yo, you are, like, you're killing me, man. <laughs> what can I do for you, Kevin? Hey, old man, what's that dice devil over there? Can I have it for $4.70? Um, so wait a sec. You want it for 470? Oh wait, do you want us to buy it? Since you asked so nicely, we purchased it for 470 and its current price is 420, right? Get real kid since you asked so nicely? Heck yes. Hopefully that brings up our reputation because we did that live, you know, live streaming. <laughs> Looks like somebody has a request. So a request. I'm looking for a card in mint condition. Expires in three days. So it doesn't matter what it is. Just a card in mint condition. How do you know if it's in mint condition? Click for price history. Um, I'd like to learn more about. Oh, that is so good. Did you see that? Look at the card. Uh, that is really cool. You can see where it's trending. That's very, very cool. Now, how do I know if a card is in mint condition? Is it in mint condition when it's like hologram? Holographic there? Not really sure. Let's talk to Giuseppe. Maybe he will tell us. You wondering what all the symbols on the cards mean? Yeah. Lucky, you've got a handsome bird like me around. The Roman numeral in the bottom left is the element hero. Wait a sec. In the bottom left, I'm assuming C. It is his power. Okay. The symbol in the bottom right of this element hero is its ability. Oh, wait, maybe the X in the brain? Ah, I see. The small symbol in the bottom left of this elemental hero, that's the set it belongs to. So maybe C. That's what the set is C. Rare cards have gold details, like elemental hero. Gold details, so I guess like the gold trim maybe. Uncommon cards have silver which is that one. And then common cards have no de detailing at all. So it's just a blank card. So, OK, so there's the commons, the uncommons, and then the uh, the the rares. Need me to repeat that again? No, I think I got it. Every card can also be shiny like this Snoop bat. OK, so that's what the hologram is. It's a shiny shiny cards are worth double the money. OK, that's very good information there. Wow, there, this game is like throwing so much. <laughs> <laughs> so much stuff at me right now. I'm enjoying it though. Um, does not look like we could buy any boosters today. That's fine. Still wondering how to like know when you are or when you have a a mint condition card like these. I'm assuming maybe every card that's not damage is like like this is considered mint condition, right? Maybe I don't know. Maybe the game will tell us. Uh, how's our news still? Uh, free purple cards in in a, in a kids meal like. Stay away from the purple, right? Do I? Am I blocking that? I am kind of blocking that in a little bit. All right. So, uh, yeah, I think we are ready to turn in for the night. Let's do it. Turn in for the night. Open seven days a week. Look for the cards that are affected by multiple news events to make serious money. We're going to get more mail, I think, today. Yeah. Friday. Usually busy on Fridays. Reputation up. Rush hour chance. Still 10%. 
Okay, request still want the, that in two days, right? I, I assume I'm just gonna give it to him or give him something. Um, right, okay, okay, okay. Oh my God, help me out here. The world card shop card composition sets. Um, card compositions, power, rarity. Uh, the world. Oh my God, there's a lot of info here. Reputation, requests, sets. Oh my Lord. This is really cool. <laughs> I dig it. Okay, so the news for today. Hang on a sec. Let's hang on a sec. Back this, back this, back this out. Back this out. Back this out here. I don't need this. We're done here. We're done. We're done. Okay. Uh, news. What's the news for today? Uh, maze dwellers and street wizards will be reprinted soon. That doesn't sound good. Okay. Get, get that out of here. Rumor. Rumor, Francis Barone reveals all good things is her favorite set. I don't know who Francis Barone is, but apparently it's her favorite set. This is our delivery guy. Uh, got some mail for you. Ooh, mail. Oh God, we have quite a few. There we go. Break that open. That will give us our green country monkey. Very good. This is another one. More green cards. Yep, there's our shinies coming through. That's a common shiny. Now that I, I need to start saying those out loud so that I understand what's going on here. This is the damaged green. All right. So how much money do we have? Fourteen seventy. Uh, Giuseppe has something to say. You see that tags tray down there? Putting tags on cards gains more money or reputations if used by a smart person. Try dragging a tag onto a card and see what happens. Take it from me. Smart and pretty. So a tag. Oh, this. So card reputation, oh, card price reputation up. This would be card price up, reputation down. Okay, we'll have to use that here in a sec. So let's go ahead and grab that. Let's grab that. Downside here, right? We've kind of like, I, I, I personally have kind of like screwed the pooch a little bit. Um, I don't have any cards up because I've been hoarding all these green cards. Now, I think maybe I'm gonna continue to do that, right? People are gonna be very upset maybe. This is my, this might be a bad idea, but holding on to my cards for I think what is be tomorrow, right? Yeah, tomorrow's the trend. Green increases, purple decreases, maze dwellers decrease on Sunday, and then all good things increasing in value. Oh, she has a question. This is B, oh, look at her. Hi, I was walking along the beach and I saw your shop. It was like a sign. I'm developing my PhD thesis and I want to study card games. So I saw your shop and was drawn to it. I'll take that as a compliment. <laughs> you don't mind answering some questions, do you? Let's do it. What's the most popular card game that you sell? Uh, Warlock. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> so what got you into card games? Um, my dad. Oh, nice. I wish my parents were that cool. Well, see you around. All right, we'll see you later. Another question. This is Christopher Marlowe. Hi there, you must be Harry. Um, I must be. I wanted to come and give my condolences for your father's passing. He was an old friend. I guess you don't remember me. Um, I'm Christopher. I am, helped your dad set the shop up back when he was a world champ. You both played Warlock? Harry, Christopher invented Warlock. His name's on every pack. Uh, I was being ironic <laughs> or oh, dumb me. Me dumb? <laughs> Whoa, don't pin it all on me, Giuseppe. Harry, if you're anything like your father, I'll have to card battle you sometime. Card battle? <laughs> Joker, uh, just like your father. That's great. Anyways, I'm back in Parakeet Bay for a while. I'll pop in when I can. See you, boys. All right, that's kind of cool. All right, so Christopher's a kind of a cool cat there. Yeah, so I think I'm holding on. I'm going to hold on to what I have here. I'm going to check this. Warlock's later releases. Looks like the startled bananas are still coming through here. Um, these are potential things that we can bring in for sure. Damage cards as well. Uh, some more things that we can bring in. I can also get some greens, right? Yep, there's the green. Now, that is a shiny common, though. But it's a four, I guess. And there's an X. Purple's going to go down in value. Even though that's a $20 card, purple's going to go down in value. I'm going to add... Hang on a second. Let me. I, I got. I'm gonna think about this here. Warlock's late, latest releases. Monkey Bot is a dollar eighty five. Startled Bananas two fifteen. These are easy buys, right? They're very easy buys. Damage cards. We could bring in. We can bring in damaged green cards. It's very cheap to do, and I think they'll just go up in and they'll increase in price, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. All that glitters, which is the shinies. 
I think that's a lot of money. Eight dollars and forty cents. Like what is no no no. Cancel that. What is like that's just a no, that's that's not a common. That's okay, that's an uncommon because that's silver. That's an uncommon. I'm not sold on that, dude. Unless there's like power and abilities that really get people going here. I'm not sold on that right now. These new releases, I'm going to bring them in. I'm going to bring them in. They're cheap and they're new, but they're all commons. So we're going to see what happens there. How much is that all together? $11.40. Yeah, I think that's fine. So we'll go ahead and check out there. We'll keep the $7.65. Again, the request here is have a card in mint condition. Uh, I guess we can just like, give him something. Anything. So let's see here. Let's give him a common Bat King 2. Can we do that? There you go. Okay, so that, that's what it is. So any card that looks like this is considered mint condition. The damage is damage. So there we go. $4 there. So we could now reinvest that $4 into a green wall game group shiny common. <laughs> um, maybe not. We could go into some uh, damaged cards here. We know purple's going to go down in value. Let me see what the event is here once again. Green's going to go up. All good things are going to go up. And then what's going to decrease is maze dwellers and street wizards. So what I'm going to actually do is I'm going to turn in and I'm going to hold on to my cash. Yeah, I'm going to hold on to my cash and hope something different is going to happen tomorrow. So Warlock News Network, green cards uh, condemned by the church for the satanic implications have all now been increased. As you can see, earn reputation by fulfilling requests. OK, we already know that we're fine with that. Dude, this game is kind of sick. <laughs> it's like really cool. So Saturday, usually busy. All righty. Now with tags, we still haven't used. So today, hang on a sec. Today is the day, right? Yeah. So we're going to get all of our green cards out there. Uh, yeah, so seven dollars for the monkey Dice devil five dollars there um, I gotta send that one out as well city of thieves. Oh, baby. That's a good one and then um, Bat King two and then what else? Uh, 370 a damaged monkey one. So there we go. Where's our news at for today? Um, news is reports thieves are targeting cards with the brawn ability that's not good. So they could steal that. That has the brawn ability. That has the brawn ability. That's one of our most expensive cards. That's not good. And that has the brawn ability. So all of our brawn ability cards are some of our most expensive cards. So let's go ahead and increase our price on a non brawn ability card, which is going to be this one. There we go. We'll increase the tag on that one. So that's going to go up to 890. Go do not steal my card. <laughs> do not steal from me dude all right question this is delcon oregon oh yeah that's the it said in the um in the in the calendar he was gonna come hey boyo what's the craic i'm delcon delcon oregon i'm from the commonwealth card retailers union and i'll be popping in once a week to see how you are doing wow we set up shop goals and reward you with decorations that's what unions do right anyway have a decoration on the house God, you're joking. A little Bulbasaur? That has to be Bulbasaur, right? Why don't you select another shop goal? Very well. Gain 21 cards within seven days. Spend at least $17 on decorations within 17 days. Um, I think I want to go with gain 21 cards. So right on. I'll jot that down. Oh, and here's some tags to help you out. Oh, very good. So we got card prices increases and I didn't see the other one anyway <laughs> I've got a I gotta crack on I'll be back next week or whenever you finish your shop goal oh if you want to check out your store slap that paintbrush over there oh slap it baby okay so here we go now we can edit did you see the Bulbasaur dude that's a Bulbasaur I'm putting that thing right there that is so good <laughs> I love it all right do not steal my bronze my brawls, my bronze is a bronze. There's our mail, our courier coming in. There we go. We sold that. Thank God we sold that. <laughs> that was an expensive card sitting there. Hello, my good man. Got some mail for you. Thank you. Thank you. Let's see. I forgot what I order all the time. Even in other games I play, I forget what I ordered. So a couple green cards, damaged green cards, but that's all right. 
Uh, there's our startled banana and our monkey bot. So that was like the new featured items. Let's go ahead and put these cards out. We'll go back king now over here. We'll go back king over here. And this is like probably one of the times that we can take advantage of the damage cards. So that guy bought a damage card. That is dice devil. This person has a question. Oh my God, look at her. <laughs> Eofi Lerosha. Sorry to bother you, but you wouldn't happen to have seen a small dog anywhere, would you? What's its power level? What set was he in? It is common or uncommon or rare. Uh, pardon me? The dog card you're looking for. No, she's looking for my real my real dog. Oh, I see. I was so confused. Uh, these look so pretty. Do you make them yourselves? Uh, no, it's a big game. Oh, of course. I'm really not awake. I'm really not awake today. Okay. I really must find my poor dog, but I would love some of these cards to pin on my makeup table. Here, have some on the house. No, I can't accept them for nothing in return. It's cool. I'll get good karma. <laughs> oh, well, thank you very much. I'll try and pop in next time my silly dog gets himself lost. I'm Iofi. I don't know. I've never seen a name like that before. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right, by the way. Well, I'm Harry. Lovely to meet you. Harry, ciao. Still selling our green cards at a high rate here. We have $30. It's incredible. Oh, baby. It's, it's also it's so good. I might want to throw a tag on another. No, I'm going to hold on to my tags. We have a phone call for a request. Bat King, damaged Bat King has been sold. What's our request? A card with brain in mint condition. I think I might have that. A card with brain in mint condition. I do not have that in my collection. Might have it over here. How much are you willing to pay me? 335 uh, yeah, I don't really have that right now. Okay, let's go to our shop. $33. Let's see what we have. Allie sells everything. My God, I love how this thing changes all the time. All that gifts matter. Um, I don't think I'm interested in that right now. Allie sells everything. Now, we don't need to target green cards anymore right now because that's kind of already came and gone, right? We've, we've already taken advantage of it. Let's see what we have coming up on the, on the menu here. We do have a higher trend in all good things, increasing in value. Brawn decreases in value tomorrow. Maze Dwellers and Street Wizards decrease in value as well. So that means we can go to all, all good things. So a, an entire pack of all good things. These are bad. We do not want this. Conjunction is nothing. And nobody said anything about conjunction, but we're going to buy a pack of warlock all things good so that's since that's going to be uh you, you know it's going to be going good here so hang on a sec when is that is that tomorrow no it's the day after tomorrow so we're going to get the cards in tomorrow the booster pack in tomorrow and then on monday we'll go ahead and sell that this is sick dude autumn summer okay um right so gain 21 cards where are we at do we can can we see at our entire goal here i get there's like a tiny little bar here but it doesn't show me exactly everything <laughs> okay so yeah let's go ahead and bring that in so 15 dollars. oh my god yeah now do we get anything from ally here do we take a shot in the dark here um does she have any like like this right here is a 20 dollar card but this right here is like a uncommon Onric and War Biscuit. Where? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if I if I I should do that. I really shouldn't. Myrtle and Peter. This is M. M set. I gotta learn the sets and things like that. Okay. You you know what? I'm gonna hold on to my seventeen dollars. Yeah, I'm gonna hold on to my seventeen dollars and go from there. Um, our current prices for these are very standard, so there's no profit to be made with these these cards here. What was our request again? Mint with a brain? I think we have a brain, but we don't have it in mint condition. Okay, let's turn in for the night. Yeah. I'm really enjoying this game. So reports. Oh, God. So the Maze Dwellers, all the sets in the Maze Dwellers and Street Wizards have all gone down in, in, in price. We were already we were already expecting this because that was down in the Brawlers, right? We, we were expecting this. This isn't like something out of the ordinary. Like we knew it was going to happen. Today's going to be a bad day. Unfortunately, Sundays are usually busy, but today's going to be a bad day money wise, I guess. So let's see your news. Anything in the news? Mark Rosenthorn, Warlock Company finally added Plumeria to the ban list. Sorry, investors. Um, all good things will be reprinted in two days. F, but we have the big day right here, right? All good things are good right here. This is all bad. All good things is bad here and Plumeria also. Uh, what is OK? So we're still looking for the uh, like the mint condition brain. OK, where can we sit on our 
cards here. I guess Bat King can kind of go out again. You know what? Let's do that. Let's go Bat King out. These cards, these two in particular, have gone down in value. Monkey Bot as a common regular card, you can make 10 cents off of. Okay, um, right. Now we can increase the value of some of these cards as well with a couple of tags, which I think I'm going to do with this card right here. I'm going to increase the value on that, and then I'm going to increase the reputation. What is the value of increasing the reputation, I wonder? I'm not really sure. There's three more tags that we haven't discovered also. So there's our mail carrier. Hello, my good man. How are you? This should be our booster pack, right? There we go. Come on, baby. Yeah, oh, I can't wait. Booster pack. Send it, dude. Oh, let's see here. Sand Pirates. Box Demon. Common. Common. It's a card, dude. It's a card that was 10 bucks that I was thinking about buying. That's a uh, Uncommon Ornick and War Biscuit. Oh, that's sick. Okay, okay, okay. Um, so wait a sec. So we can at least maybe get... Okay, this guy's looking for a mint condition brain. We have to have a brain at least, yeah? Did someone just steal from me? What's that noise? No, there's a dog. That's the dog. That's Isn't that her dog? Or maybe that's his dog. What the heck is that noise? That thing is making some weird noises. Look at it. Picola? Picola? Woof? Uh, woof, woof. Word. <laughs> What can I do for you, Picola? Bork, Wolf, Wolf. Seems like he wants me to compare these two decks. He, a dog wants me to compare the two decks. We have Shut the F Up. Red deck wins. Okay, total attack 102. Deck ability, beauty. Deck ability, brawn. Total attack 84. Predict deck, which... Oh, we have to predict which deck will win. I mean, I'm going to go with total attack. Because I... Okay, wait a sec. Counters brain and countered by brawn. Counters beauty countered by brain. So actually, red deck wins then. Winner! By absolutely demolishing the opponent. By having a higher power and having a more diverse set of colors. Interesting. Piccola, I just beat a dog. <laughs> okay, there we go. Awesome, good money there. No rush hour today. Very good to see. I don't know. I'm scared for rush hour. I'll be honest with you. There we go. Good money there. Come on. Buy the city thieves. Buy the city thieves. You know you want it. Oh, she does want it. And she got the tag to go along with it. She's going to love it. There you go. Awesome. Woo. 40 bucks coming in hot. Giuseppe wants something to say. I looked at the Warlock release schedule and there's a set releasing next week. What is a set? Groups of Warlock cards are released together in sets. The Warlock company releases a new set every couple of weeks to keep the game fresh. Oh, I see. Anyway, your dad you would usually throw a party when a new set came out. I think we should do that too. It's a good way to build a community and meet new customers. Uh, yeah, let's do that. That sounds incredible. Done. It's on your calendar. Oh, Friday the 12th, we're going to have a freaking card community day. That's going to be awesome. So tomorrow is going to be all good things increasing value. So tomorrow, all these cards that we have here, for the most part, not all of them, but for the most part, will go on um, up in value. So that's going to be good to see. Uh, yeah, so I mean, $40. We did pretty good today. Let's go ahead and see what we got going on here. So this is going to be all that glitters. Let's see what we have in all that glitters. Uh, there's a like rare, shiny, elemental Starvos. That's kind of crazy, dude. Warlock latest releases, which are some of these ones that we got. There's a cold cutlery monkey. Not really interested in that. Damage, a bunch of damage cards that we can bring in. Also, parakeet antiques. Oh, these, <laughs> these are actually oh more decorations. Oh, I love this. Deal of the day. So for 50% off, you can actually get this. A wall hanging that says some cards must be worn above the neck at all times <laughs> okay tips i don't know if this will give us tips or if it's all cosmetic but this is kind of cool I'm, i don't want to spend money on that quite yet i don't know i don't know where i should I, I need to get more cards in i do i do need to get more cards in so um some of these oh wait 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 hang on hang on hang on i know what i can do let's go to our collection first Okay, so all things good. That's with the A, right? The A at the bottom left. That's all things good, right? Of the bottom left card. A, all things good. So maybe what we do is we buy cards for tomorrow that is part of that set, like the banana. But that's $3. But that's a shiny banana. It is a common shiny. I might buy it. I'm going to add that to the cart. Warlock releases. We can get these in again, right? Oh, this... 
cutlery monkey monkey is part of um uh it's part of uh all all good things too i think i might buy it no i can't buy it because what if i don't end up selling it then i'm stuck with it right let's go for the cheap set here so monkey bot i'll bring that in it's a cheap set it's a cheap card for the set same with this if these end up selling great if they don't i only spent a dollar on them that's my theory behind that yeah yeah i think that's what i'm gonna do so eight dollars and 25 cents i'll check out so then let's go ahead and like maybe buy a decoration item i should have done that all in the same freaking boat shouldn't i have so i, so I didn't have to pay shipping twice god damn it <laughs> all right anyways we'll do that and then um what's tomorrow tomorrow's just a big decrease in everything okay yep let's go so there we go all good things is her favorite set rumor from francis barone that now has increased all of the value for all good things sets that's gonna be great that went up four dollars and fifty cents the ornick uh war biscuit that we actually got from the pack that we opened oh dude this this is sick Usually quiet on a Monday, reputation plus average, rush hour chance, only 10%. Okay, so today might be a slow day. I love how you, did, I love how you have to even like think about, uh, oh, by the way, um, it's going to be a Monday. It might be a little bit slower, you know what I mean? That's kind of fun. Warlock news, let's see, a recent tournament sees beauty decks clean up the competition. So I wonder if beauty decks, yeah, beauty decks are going to increase in value on thursday so kind of like wait for that still looking for a brain and mint condition i uh, still don't think we have a brain and mint condition now this is big money so we're gonna get that out there every card that needs to go out there now from a booster three dollars there actually hang on a sec put that back um i want the yeah big big guys out there first there we go put the banana out there put that banana out there and then let's go ahead and do uh yeah the ship sand pirates and then what i'll do is i'll add a price to this one boom 18 dollars card we got it from a booster pack that i believe the booster pack was like 13 bucks or maybe 10 bucks so yeah that card already pays for the entire booster pack hello how are you this is francis barone where is it pardon the legendary card keep up peasant i uh, will i i don't have anything here do you know who i am I'm Francis Barone, the International Warlock Pro, former world champion. I'm here for the legendary card. I'm not taking no for an answer. Give it to me. Oh, I have a poster of you. <laughs> you want to play games? You leave me amused. I'm the queen of cards. I never lose. Did you practice that in the mirror? <laughs> did she just walk away now? What was she wanting? What was she asking for? Why did she want to get all nasty with me? Come on now. Come on now, girl. Here's our courier. Good to see him. This game is sick, dude. I like this game a lot. Posty, I got some mail for me, for you. Oh yeah, we got a few bot. We got one box and two letters. So there's our couple damage cards that we were looking for for the all set, the all good set, which were kind of just like fillers, really. Even though we totally disregarded, it. I did not know that it was going to be a slow Monday. But there we are. This is a shiny common uh, startled banana, and then we have a big box. My lord, that is loud. Oh, beards. I thought it was cards. Beards must be worn above the neck at all times. Okay, that's kind of fun. Uh, okay. Where, where, where? I guess I have to take... You know what? I'm taking down Barone. Get put down, Barone. <laughs> Sorry, sweetheart, but you're kind of being rude, so you're gone. Get out of here. There we go. So this person is going to buy a startled banana. Very good. No, no, that was the sea. Sorry, the sand. Uh, we want this startled, the shiny startled. Rush hour? Okay, rush hour is here. 10% chance. It's actually happening. Question here. Kai, is this the card shop? The one that vo the voice was talking about? I'm not crazy, I swear. Giuseppe, you sound crazy. Oh, great. Now I can hear birds talking too. No, everyone can hear him, unfortunately. Look, exams are soon, so I was studying in the library when this dusty old book fell on my head. It had a weird symbol on the cover, and when I opened it, the voice started talking inside my mind. That's hectic. He said I was like protector of the cards. Then the then these monsters appeared and the books burst into flames. The last thing he said was to find George Sue's a card shop by the beach and he would explain everything. My dad, well, he died though. Oh, great, that's just perfect. Oh, uh, my condolences by the way. Don't worry about him. 
The symbol on the book, the one that repelled the monsters, was it on the one, uh, one, of, uh, uh, one on these warlock cards? We could give you some cards. I can't believe this. I have enough on my plate with school. Fine, thanks. Hopefully this wards them off. Jeez. Okay, so back to the rush hour. <laughs> she came in with a sword, dude. Sell him that. There you go. Sell him that. Bring it in. Sell you that. What do we got here? Another request. What's must with the, what's the other request? A yellow card M from the set. So a yellow card M. Okay, so we don't have a yellow card from that set. We don't even have enough for the other uh, other thing that's going on here, like the brain with the mint condition. So that was the day. So that was um that was the all good set day that actually went pretty good. It did went decently. Um. We did get our first rush hour as well, so that was cool to see. What do we have going on tomorrow? We have all good things, even though they were increased in value today. They go down in value tomorrow. And then Plumeria added to the ban list. So let's go ahead and go here and see what we can get ourselves into. So the Warlock latest release. Um, wow, look at that. That's a rare Mercharkin? Mercharkin? That's kind of cool. I love the artwork in this game. They did such a good job. Conjunction. The only pack that we can get is a conjunction. I haven't heard anything about conjunction, so I'm going to go ahead and actually buy a pack just to fill up the the uh, the store here. Looks like we have some more damage cards that we can get ourselves into as well. Um, Not really interested, I don't think. Not really interested in getting any damage cards right now. Do we have any big brain mint condition? We don't have any big brain mint condition. What's new here? Deal of the day, a curtain, a broken curtain. I don't, I'm not interested in that. What is that? Grass? Looks like more decorations. Again, the decorations, they help out our, our reputation, I believe, right? I think that's what it is. I think I'm going to go two booster packs. Two booster packs? $22? Three booster packs? $31? Let's do it. Let's just rip them up, dude. Yeah, payment successful. Fantastic. All right. Send me off. <laughs> Send me off. All good things are going down in value, which is everything that we had in our entire collection. But now that we have this new three booster pack coming through, maybe we get something good here. Tuesday is usually quiet. Good to see, right? Or not good to see, but good to know knowledge wise. So our value in our in our and our card over here is $17, but $17 still pays for that entire booster pack that we got it from. So it's not that big of a deal, but it is there. All right, so we'll just sit here to speed up the time. Wait for some customers to come in and then we'll start doing it. Now, hang on a sec. Do I dare put in like, well, you know what? Let's put in box of demon. Yeah, got that from a booster. Uh, Monkey bot, we'll put that down. That's actually going for a lot of money right now. And then, uh, yeah, put down this as well. And then this also. There we go. And we'll give him some of that. Thank you. Thank you. I love the bubble sword, dude. Um, yep, Posty. Thank you for the mail, Posty. Should be three boosters. So here we go. Three boosters. First booster pack. Looks like a uncommon rage rider from the C collection. Master of Secret Arts. De facto. Oh, the C. The C. It's the, uh, yeah, never mind. I know why. Because <laughs> we bought the freaking booster pack. Um, okay, common. Okay, so there was an uncommon in there. That was pretty much it. There's another uncommon. Common. 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 Oh, yeah, I forgot that we need to gain 21 cards anyways. This is part of our goal that we got going on. Here's another common. Another common. Yo, this is a rare, right? Elemental Hero Starvos. That's a rare. So we, we pulled something. There's a tag with some extra money added to that. We have another person coming in. It's, what is that sound? Dabo, hey Harry, do you guys trade? Do you do trades? I'll give you this blade demon for the de facto. Terrible, what happened there? Why was that? What happened with the reputation? I don't know what just happened. I'll give you this blade demon for that de facto. Oh, dude. So this blade demon is currently priced at $3.10 and it is an uncommon and he wants a yellow common that we got from a booster pack that we can sell for $1.65. Yeah, you know what? I'll, I'll take your blade demon, dude. There you go. Ripper, see ya, mate. See ya later. Okay, what happened while I was like trying to talk to this man? Why we got terrible uh, reputation all of a sudden? Wait. <gasps> Did somebody take our card? Or did somebody... 
buy that card. I really hope nobody just took that card for their own own personal gain. Now we have a ton of cards here. Um, okay, uh, we want brain with mint condition. So let's see if we could buy a brain. That's well, I'm not giving him that card. I'll tell you that. Um, this is a brain with mint condition. Wait a sec. Hang on a sec. How much is that value of that card though? Two dollars. Okay. Two dollars. Kind of like. No, oh, this is fine. We'll give him this. So brain with mint condition. Why did everything just go black? Giuseppe? Hmm. Looks like the power's gone out. Yeah, you think? You... What in the Yu-Gi-Oh is this? Phantom Mass. Greetings, Harry Sue. <laughs> Scream, a witch? My name. You know how? I might know many things. What number am I thinking of? 69. That's incredible. Amazing, also nice. I am. The Phantom Mask, internationally renowned card thief. I heard this establishment had a new owner, quite the card master, so I thought I paid them a visit. You won't steal our cards. Cute. If I wanted something from you, you wouldn't have seen me. No, I grace you with my presence to furnish you with a, ra with a rare gift. This legendary card, keep it safe. Tell no one about our meeting. I will be watching you. Both. Adios. Whoa. Oh, ho, 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 ho. This is the legendary card? Wow. I guess we've been always searching for the legendary card. So Burger Place included free yellow cards in a kid's meal, which hurts us. Damn it. That's fine. Um... Wednesday, usually quiet. Re t reputation terrible because for some reason something happened. But I think that's going to do it in today's episode, episode one. If you guys want to see more Cardboard Kings, I really, really did enjoy this. I really do enjoy this game so far. So if you want to see more, please make sure to let me know down in the comment section below. Hit the like button and I will see you all in the next episode or in the next video, wherever that may be. And do as always, take care.